Oh, hey everybody, I'm JJ, good morning. How do you start your mornings? Write about it in the comments. Oh, it's finally morning. It feels like I've been asleep forever. I wonder what kind of day today will be. It's 7 a.m. and it's still a nice day. That's all because Mikey still hasn't had time to do any problems. I should wake him up already. Oh, Mikey, you're up now? Yeah, I woke up early today. I can't sleep anymore. Yeah, it happens. What if we go for a walk? The weather looks nice outside. Walking? Hmm, sounds good. It's been a while. Where should we go? Why don't we just walk around town? Grab a bite to eat. See what's new. That's a good idea. And we'll see what's going on in the park. Maybe we'll meet someone we know. That's great. Then let's pack up and go. We've been home all week. It's time to get some air. Exactly. Fresh air never hurt anyone. All right, ready? Yeah, nothing to do anyway. Where are my sneakers? Mikey, you're a turtle with a TV on your head. You don't need sneakers. Let's hurry up or I don't want to miss this sunny day. Great weather. Even the birds are singing. I didn't get you out of the house for nothing. Yeah, it's breezy. Just like the days when we used to run around the yard as little kids. Hey, Mikey, remember when we used to run races when we were kids? You were always bragging about how you were faster than me. Well, it's true. I'm still faster than you. I'm as fast as Sonic. Sonic, you say? Uh-huh. You may be a fast walker, but I can still beat you at running. Are you serious? Huh, if we were competing now, I'd be at the next light while you were still at the start. Okay, I need to find someone. Ha ha ha. Hey, Mikey, there's a weird guy behind you. Uh, what are you talking about? Hey, guys, sorry to bother you, but do you have a cell phone? I need to make a call right away. I lost my son. He's a little kid. Uh, no, we don't have a phone. Quietly, Mikey. He's kind of weird. Come on, don't be like that. You gotta help people. Here, take my phone, but make it quick, okay? Thank you, thank you. You really helped me out. I'll be quick, don't worry. Mikey, you're making a big mistake. You can't just give your phone to the first person you see. JJ, you have to trust people and not be so distrustful. Thanks for the phone, guys. I'm only gonna make one call. If I was in trouble, you wouldn't help me, JJ. You're my friend, Mikey. I'd always help you, but helping strangers is dangerous. Bye-bye, fools. Ha ha ha. Mikey, he's running away with your phone. Hey, stop. That's my phone. I told you he was suspicious. You always believe everything. Let's go get him. Oh, how was I supposed to know? I thought he'd really lost his son. Okay, we'll figure it out later. We gotta get your phone back. Ha, catch up if you can, little ones. Fast as Sonic, huh? I'll catch up with you and you'll be sorry, you stupid, insolent thief. This phone will be mine. I hope they lost me in those woods. He's turning into the woods. We can't lose him. I see him. We've got to keep going. We're almost there. Why are you so stubborn? You'll never catch up with me. I'll definitely, uh, I'll catch up. If this is, uh, is the last thing I do. He thinks he can hide in the woods? Let's show him who's fastest. Oh my God. Why are they so tough? I'm tired of running away from you. I can't run that long anymore. I'm too tired, but I won't quit. He won't leave with my phone, JJ. I'm tired too, but Mikey, we're almost there. Did you see that? He He's already slowing down. These woods aren't gonna save him. We're not only smart, but we're tough too. Let's show him how to run. Oh, come on. How do these guys have so much power? Okay, we just need to find a place to hide or do something to distract them. I think I know where I can hide. They can't see me there. You don't scare us, man. You better give me the phone and let's end this the easy way. Well, he obviously doesn't want to do it the easy way, so he'll do it the hard way. If I don't catch him, we'll definitely do something to stop him. God, they're really not giving up. Well, it's time for plan B. <laughs> hey, you see that? He ran into the abandoned house. Yeah, I can see that. This place looks like a trap. It's private property. Get out of here, kids. Ha ha ha. But we have no choice. We have to go after him. Are you sure? In movies, places like this always end badly. But I won't leave you alone. Yeah, once we get here, there's no going back. If he's hiding out there, that means he's at the end of the road. All right, let's go. It's all so old and abandoned. Just be on the lookout. If it's a trap, we have to be ready. We're gonna get through this together. Listen, Mikey, this place is weird. Are you sure he came in here? It's too quiet. Yeah, I definitely saw him. He ran in here. But where could he have gone? There's obviously something wrong here. Maybe he's lurking in a corner somewhere or gone through some secret exit. Hey, JJ, look what I found. It's some kind of potion. Maybe it's magical. Are you kidding me, Mikey? We're looking for a cell phone, not ancient artifacts. Who needs a potion anyway? Well, I just thought it might come in handy. You're at it again. Instead of focusing on what's important, you found some crap. Oh, come on, I was just trying to help. You wanna help? Then listen to your big brother. Did you forget how much your phone costs? A thousand dollars and this potion, it's just trash. Why would he do that? I just wanted to find something interesting. I don't understand why JJ's always so serious. Always listening to his big brother, what does he know? I mean, he always gets it right and I, well, I didn't mean it badly.
Why would he do that? I may be a junior, but that doesn't mean I can't be helpful. I was just trying to help, and now you've ruined it again. Maybe he's right. I'm always in the way. Potion. I guess I just found another piece of crap. What do I do with it now? It would be nice if someone understood me. Why is it so complicated? Okay, enough crying. I'm sick of it. JJ thinks he's the smartest and most responsible. Maybe he's right, but it's time for a change. Maybe JJ was right, and this potion is just garbage. But what if it was? Okay, time to try this weird potion. Well, if it's bad, it can't get any worse. Maybe I'll become invisible or superpowered. Who knows? Ew, it tastes disgusting. What's, what's going on? Why am I getting big? Whoa, what's happening to me? I'm turning. But, um, I don't feel kind. I'm hungry. I would eat some man. A very big and delicious man. Where can I find something to eat around here? I won't rest until I eat something. Time to go see my big brother. I bet he's delicious. Three hours later. Where's Mikey? He should have been back a long time ago. Did he do something else? Mikey's not answering his cell phone. Oh, I forgot, his phone was stolen. Oh man, he always gets into trouble when he's alone. Maybe I should have gone back for him. It's not safe out at night. I shouldn't have gotten so angry. But where could he be for so long? Hey, who's there? Someone rang the doorbell. I'm on my way. Oh, no one's here? Really? I know someone was here. I couldn't make it up. If it's Mikey, why is he fooling around like that? Why isn't he answering? No one. I must have heard it. All right, I'll go home. It's getting late and I'm starting to freak out about these noises. What? Another call? Who is it this time? What is this? Okay, this time I'll know exactly who it is. I'm gonna hit that little joker with my bat. Ah, nobody again? What nonsense is this? This is really starting to piss me off. As if I don't have enough problems, I'm getting these calls. If it's someone messing around again, I'll be so mad at them, I won't... Ah! What is this? Oh my god! Eating! I'm hungry! Mikey, is that you? What happened to you? I'm not Mikey. I'm a green Sonic and I'm hungry! Ah, that's not funny! You look like a monster! Don't you understand? I became evil because I drank that potion. It gave me power. Why do you need power? You can do something normal. Get away from me. You're scary. Ah! Normal. I want to eat, and I need you for that. I hope he doesn't come through here. Ah! Oh my god, you insatiable animal. You can't run away from me. I'm faster. I'm Green Sonic. I'm not going to wait for you to decide how to eat me. Get out of my house. You're not my brother anymore. Run, JJ, run! But sooner or later, you'll be my dinner, sweetie. Guys, how do I escape this monster? Write about it in the comments. I better hide in this closet before he catches up with me and eats me. I'll break this whole house down, but I'll eat you, JJ. By the way, your feet look very appetizing. Mikey, it's me, JJ. Remember, I'm your brother. Come back. I know you're in there somewhere. I'm not Mikey. I'm a green Sonic, and I need to eat. You can't just eat me. I'm your brother. Remember how we used to play together all the time? He doesn't seem to care. I've got nowhere else to go. I don't want to end my life in that stupid monster's mouth. Games don't interest me. I'm hungry. What is wrong with you? You don't have to be like this. You have to remember who you are. I'm stronger and faster than ever. It's just a potion. JJ, there's nowhere to run. Your time has come. Not today. Ha ha ha. There's always been stairs. I'll still be alive today. How annoying you are. I'm very fast and I'll still catch up with you. No, I'm not gonna let you do this. I'll find a way to bring you back. I can even jump off the roof because I'm a green Sonic. Ha ha ha. Ah, that fast? Really? You can't stop me. Oh my god, why me? This world is not fair to me. Come here, my sweet and delicious JJ. Ah, don't eat me. Go get some burgers and chips. That's what Mikey liked to eat. I can't take it anymore. He's too close. I'm scared. You're not getting away from me. I'm almost there, and I can feel you close. When are you gonna get tired? Because my strength is running out. You know I'm not gonna let myself get eaten just like that. I'm gonna fight back. Resistance is useless, JJ. I have no other choice. We have to jump in the water. I still have the strength to swim. Don't even think about jumping into that river or I'll punish you. Uh, you afraid of the water, Green Sonic? Ha ha ha. You will not escape your fate. I'll get you anyway. No, please, not again. I don't want you to eat me. Now I'm going to jump into the water, making a bunch of splashes, landing right on your head. Ah, uh, get away from me, you stupid piranha. Wait, you're turning back. Are you serious? Water makes you normal again, Mikey. I can't 
do this anymore. I hope the prank was funny. What did you say, prank? You were playing a joke on me? It wasn't funny. Hold on, JJ. It was just a prank. Just a prank. I'm gonna show him how much fun I'm having. Nah! Ouch, I'm sorry. Take that, stupid Mikey. Don't ever scare me like that again. Ah! Uh. Hey everyone, today I came over to Mikey's house to watch him play on the computer and maybe play a game myself. I have a super cool laptop and I'll let you play after I pass this hard level. You're playing Minecraft, there are no levels. Yeah. <laughs> Mikey. Come on, if you want, you can start playing right now, I'll let you. Oh, well thank you. Yeah, it's all for you. I'd rather just watch cartoons. Seriously. Um, that's where my favorite cartoon started, Sue. Hey kids, I hope you're not too busy. I need some help. Oh no. We're not too busy. I need you to go to the store and get some groceries for dinner because because I forgot, and I'm busy right now. But we just sat down to play, okay? You can buy yourself some candy with the rest of the money. Oh, candy, that's a win. We need gotta go. We'd love to go, so what should we buy? Candy, obviously. I need potatoes, carrots, some wax, and some tomatoes. I hope you'll remember. Potatoes, tomatoes, yes, we will remember. All right, here's the money. Enough for everything. Just make sure what you take is gray. Yeah, we'll pick the best what's out there. Yeah, we'll see what happens and get a better one. Yeah, where do we go? To the vegetable market, obviously. But you can go to the store, but it'll cost more. Okay, well, we'll see what we can get. Thanks for the money, we'll be back soon. Yeah, we'll definitely find the best vegetables for you, Mom. Come on, let's hurry up. All the good vegetables will be bought by the time we get there. Don't worry, I know a shortcut. We'll be at the vegetable market in no time. Okay, cool. If we get there first, we get the best what's there, and then candy. All right, come on, we gotta go somewhere over there. There's a road over there. Okay, lead the way, I'm right behind you. Come on, keep up. I hope no one knows about this road. Yeah, I hope so too. <laughs> Five minutes later. Something tells me that's not the shortest way to go. It's fine. Believe me, if we'd taken the main road, it would have been worse. There's millions of people on the road. Okay, whatever you say. Oh, this, what is it? It looks like a Mountain Dew Lake. Uh, I think these signs mean what's dangerous and toxic. What do you mean toxic? I drink Mountain Dew every day and I'm fine. I mean, it's not a Mountain Dew. Um, I don't know what it is, but it's dangerous. Well, yeah, it smells so what? <laughs> I don't think what you should drink it or come in contact with it. Mm, drinking. I like to drink. Good idea. No, Mikey. It's a hazardous waste lake, probably. I'm pretty sure what it's not. Oh my god, Mikey. It smells like my favorite drink. Brr, see, it's fine. Mikey put those signs there for a reason. What if you go bald and, I don't know, something bad happens to you. Get out of there fast. Oh, come on, that was, uh-oh. This lake is not sure what it's made of. Oh my god, Mikey, your eyes are red. What? Uh, yeah, they're a little itchy. You need to see a doctor. It's okay, let's go to the store. I want candy. Gee, Mikey, maybe you should at least get yourself checked out. It could be dangerous. It's okay, calm down. Down. Let's go before we're late. Okay, whatever, but your eyes look bad. Yeah, I feel fine. Don't worry. Okay, whatever you say. Wait for me. I can't keep up with you. Come on, hurry up. Four to six days later. JJ, come on, get up. JJ, it's time for you to go to school. Come on, get up, hurry up. You might be late. Oh, what? Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm up, I'm ready, I'm up. Oh, my God. It's 7A. Time to go. I missed my alarm clock. It's okay. The important thing is that you're going to school for the first time today. It's so cool. You got a big day. We got your stuff packed so you don't have to do anything. You're ready to go. Oh, okay, thanks. I've never been there, but I hope it's cool if you say so. Thank you very much. Yeah, we're glad you're going to school, so. It's really cool. I'm sure you'll love it. And the main thing is what you'll learn, and then you can get a cool job and become super rich and popular. Okay, I like it already. It sounds cool. I want to be super rich and peculiar. Now I'm ready to get all the knowledge of what's out there and become mega rich. Yeah, if you study hard, you can make a lot of money. Well, good luck, son. Don't let us down. Good luck, son. We believe in you. Thank you. I won't let you down. Good luck to you, too. I'm off to school. Yeah, yeah. Good luck. Well, let's see what's so cool and interesting about this school and why you can get rich there and get those good grades that make parents so happy. Maybe they'll give me candy or something. So this is a school, so I finally made it. It's been hard. I hope I don't have to come here every day. Mikey's supposed to go today, too. Hopefully he'll be here and he went to the doctor or something. Hmm, it's not too bad here. Not too many people, so what's the good of it? I don't like it too noisy. I wonder where Mikey is. Maybe he's not coming today because he's not feeling well. His red eyes look like... <laughs> Where's the high JJ? Oh, hey, Mikey, your eyes are still red. Are you okay? Yeah, 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 I'm fine. I'm so much love you. Uh, what? Are you sure you're okay? 
okay? Yeah, look what's in there. Like and subscribe. Yeah, it's cool. Are you sure you're okay? You look really, really not okay. Yeah, I'm subscribed and I liked it. It's cool. See, I'm fine. <laughs> you're just kind of, I don't know, different than usual. I just got a good night's sleep and now I want to go out with you. Uh, Mikey, what's with the knife? What? And my knife? I don't know. I liked it so much I decided to take it with me. Why do you need a knife at school? You know what? It's dangerous. If anyone takes you away from me, I'll stab them in the back. Oh my god, Mikey, you can't do that. It's bad. Hey, kids. Are you the two new kids in our class that were supposed to be here today? Uh, JJ. Uh, yeah, this is my friend Mikey's first time here today. Don't mind him. It's his first time, too. Mikey, why are you holding a knife? You know what? You can't walk around like that. I'll just, whatever. I'll put it away. I just really like it. Uh, okay. Well, follow me. I'll show you where our classroom is, and you can go there to study. Okay, cool. We'll follow you. I was told that if we study hard, we can become rich. Yeah, that's, uh, possible. Whoa, that's class. That looks cool. Yeah, have a seat. We're about to start class. And I hope you brought your books. Oh, yeah, I got it all. Good. You're so handsome. Mikey. The next day. Mikey, what? Is everything okay? Stop. No, Mikey, come on. Ah, oh, God, no. What's wrong with you? Hey, everybody, it's me again. How are you guys doing? I thought I'd go over to Mikey's and take him for a walk. Today is such an unusual day. A strange feeling, you know. Okay, I guess that's just me thinking. But, uh, what is it? An ambulance outside Mikey's house? What happened? This is all so weird, don't you think? We should go in and check it out. And the doors are completely open. Oh my god, what is it? I hope everything's okay in there. I hear strange sounds. It sounds like some kind of growling and human voices. Sounds like some kind of man and Mikey's mom. What's going on in there? We should check it out soon. Mikey? Oh my god, what's wrong with you? How did this happen? Let me go. It's illegal. Untie it. You can't keep me like this much longer. I'm going to eat you. I'm afraid it's something unscientific. Modern medicine has never encountered such a thing. We'll have to take him to the hospital and then transfer him to a lab to study the mutation. We will conduct various experiments on him to learn his abilities and invent an antidote to this creature. I hope you understand the gravity of the situation. JJ, save me. You and I are friends. You can't just stand by and watch your best friend being bullied. It's not right. Come on, untie me. Help me. Wait, is there really no other way? How could there be? Look, man, I've been in medicine for 30 years and this is the first time I've seen this. And you're a punk and you think you can cure him with words or fairy magic? Don't be ridiculous. Come on, Mikey, let's go. Oh my God, what do we do now? Shouldn't I have saved him or helped him somehow. No, JJ. I'm afraid there's nothing we could do. You've heard yourself that no one has ever encountered anything like it. What could we do in such a situation? Nothing. All we can do is wait and hope things get better soon. Or at least the way things were. I'm too worried about Mikey. That sounds really sad. Well, it'll help him. Three hours later. Help! Save me! The patient has broken out and is acting aggressive. God, help us! He's gonna kill us! Hey, where are you going? I haven't even done anything yet! Stop running away! I'll catch up with you anyway! Oh, well, I'm not really interested in you. I have another goal. I need to get revenge on someone I thought was my best friend. I begged him to save me from the doctors, but he just stood there looking at me. You can't even imagine how hurtful and painful that is. Two hours later. I'm sitting here playing our favorite game with Mikey. You know, it's really sad when you're used to doing things together and now you have to sit all alone. Actually, I could go out and meet someone else, but it feels like a betrayal. I've certainly betrayed Mikey as it is when I didn't save him when he asked, but what if I made it worse? Okay, I think we should move on with our lives. I'd like to see him and see how he's doing. Well, I think you know what I mean. Hmm? Mikey? Or, uh, oh, I must have imagined it. Nightmare. I guess I miss him too much, but I should go outside and check it out anyway. Come on, let's go. Because maybe it really was him. But then, did he run away from the hospital? Oh my god. No, that couldn't have happened. Haha, <laughs> gotcha, JJ. The fool who couldn't save me. I've come to avenge you. No, no, I need a place to hide. Oh, the pantry. Great. I hope he doesn't find me there. I'm so scared. But the truth is, he does have a point. I abandoned him, and I couldn't help it. But still, what could I do? 
Now, he's terribly resentful of me and wants to kill me. What should I do? Haha, <laughs> JJ, you think you can hide from me that easily? I can find you by scent. I can get you from under the ground, but I can find you. You got nowhere to run. I hope you realize that. Oh, you're hiding in the pantry? Very stupid, JJ. Without me, you can't even hide properly without being caught in two seconds. That's it. You're finished. You can beg for mercy, but I don't care. There you go, JJ. Now you will be the perfect dinner to end this day. At least you'll physically understand how I was abused in the hospital, injected, experimented on, but their bodies smelled of alcohol, so I wouldn't eat them. I did bite one, but it was so unpalatable that I had to spit it out. You're different. Haha. <laughs> At least now you don't have to be sad alone without your best friend. You agree with me? Oh, well, okay. Haha. <laughs> Hi, my name's Mikey. Today the stork is going to take me to some family, and I'm going to live there. I can't wait until we finally arrive so I can see my future parents. I hope they are very beautiful. Yay, now I'm going to land on someone's porch. It will probably be a big, beautiful house, and inside it will smell of food and sweets. It was a soft landing. All that was left was to wait for my parents to notice me and take me home. Hopefully it wouldn't be too long. Well, I've been lying here until tonight. Isn't there anyone here? I'll cry for my parents to hear me. Hey everybody, how you doing? I'm just getting home. I had to stay late today, so I'm really tired. Hopefully, I'll just eat and go to bed. It's been a busy day today, so a good rest certainly wouldn't hurt. I think you agree with me. What's that? Some kind of basket on my doorstep. And in it, a baby. Kid, why are you crying? I've been lying here all day, and I'm really hungry. Well, let's go to my house and I'll feed you. Really? Oh, great. I'm so glad. No problem. Come on in. We'll find something to feed you. So I guess you're going to be staying with me from now on. I'll have to give you your own room. Oh, cool. Come on in. Make yourself at home. Because, well, it's your home now. Come on into the kitchen. We'll have dinner, and then we can go to bed. It's great. I really like it here. It's really beautiful. Okay. Why don't you sit over here, and I'll see what's in the fridge for dinner. Well, I think you're gonna like it. I'm no chef, but I'm not a bad cook. I think that's about right. Here you go. Please, enjoy your meal. Oh, that looks delicious. Will you join me for dinner? Will you tell me about yourself so I can get to know you better? Haha, <laughs> how many questions you have. Of course I'll sing with you, and we'll talk about everything. Cool, I'm already glad I'm in your house. I love it. Well then, welcome home, kid. I'm sure we'll get along. If you don't like something, you tell me right away, okay? Yes, we have a deal. Six months later. Hi again, everyone. Mikey will have his first day of school today, so I helped him pack his backpack for school. It's already 7 a.m. on the clock, so we have to hurry up so we won't be late. So, let's go down to him now and tell him it's time to get ready for school. Hey, Mikey, good morning. You sitting at your computer yet? Come on, turn it off. Here's your backpack. It's your first day of school. What? School? Ah, oh, good one. Yeah, thanks, but I'm not going. Mikey, did I not make myself clear enough? I said turn off the computer and get ready for school. Here's your backpack. Be good enough to take it and come with me. Education is very important because it is the only way you will grow up to be a successful person. Okay, okay, I hear you. Will you walk me to school? I don't know where it is. Of course I'm coming with you. But after that, you're gonna go there on your own, okay? Come on, we don't have much time. Look, Mikey, the school's that way. So just memorize the way there and back now, and then you'll be on your own. All right, if anything, I've memorized the address of the house so I can ask someone for directions if I get lost. Mikey, I hope you make lots of friends at school. You'll like it. Look, we're here. All we have to do is find your teacher. She'll show you to your classroom. Here, Mikey, this is your school. It's the best in the city. The building's new. They even have a bus. What do you think? I like it already. It doesn't look as bad as I imagined it would. Well, I think you're right, and I'm gonna like it here. Well, that's great. Let's go inside and hand you over to the teacher. Wow, this place is nice and spacious. Yeah, Mikey, you're gonna 
going to be a student here now, so get used to it. Look, what's that written on the board? What? Where? On that board at the end of the room. Hmm? Oh, that's a reminder to like this video and subscribe to the channel. Oh, that sounds really cool. Now I get it. All right, Mikey. First lesson in life learned doesn't mean you won't go to all the others, so follow me. Okay, where are we going? I can't wait for the school day to start. Mikey, be quiet. This isn't a playground. Wait for the teacher to come out and show you to your classroom. In the meantime, just stay close and try not to make any noise. Hello, how can I help you? Oh, yes, hello. I brought Mikey. It's his first day of school. He's new. Could you show him to his classroom and tell him the rules of the school? Oh, you're Mr. JJ. Sure, I'll help Mikey on his first day of school. Everything will be at its best. Come on, I'll take you to your classmates. Class has already started. You're a little late, but that's okay. Next time, take the school bus. You will simply need to approach the bus driver and provide your address. After that, you will be able to use it absolutely free of charge. That's it, Mikey. This is your class. Come in quietly and sit in any seat available. All the children in the class are very friendly and welcoming, and you are sure to make lots of friends. Sounds great. All right, I'm gonna go. I'll meet you after school, okay? Yeah, sure, Mikey. If you get hurt, tell your teacher. I wish you good luck and look forward to hearing about your first day of school. I assure you, everything will be fine. Don't worry. Goodbye. Ah, that's how it is. Okay, well, it's not like anything's gonna happen to him, so I can go about my day. By the way, I'll remind you again so you definitely don't forget. Like this video and subscribe to the channel. It's the best support. Also, write in the comments do you like school or not, and I'll go... Three hours later. Hey, everybody! I'm playing a game of Mikey. Just for fun, I deleted all his saves. It's gonna be awesome. Although, it's my computer and my game. Looks like I just made a joke on myself. Oh, Mikey, hey, how was your first day of school? Uh, it's okay. Okay, what happened? Why are you so sad? Nothing. It's just my shoelaces came untied. Get your head up. Something's wrong. No, everyone will laugh. There's no one here. No one will laugh. All right, then. There you go. <laughs> oh, my God. Who painted you like that? <laughs> you said you wouldn't laugh. I couldn't hold it in. Okay, what happened? I got beat up by the older kids for being the new guy in class. Oh, that must be unpleasant. Of course it's unpleasant. It's also very painful. You know, Mikey, I think I know a way to help you beat them. As soon as they see you, they will immediately run away in fear. Uh, what do I have to do to do that? It's simple. You need to go to the gym and become a jock. Oh, then I can beat the high school kids easily because I'll be strong. You got that right, Mikey. Then let's go there quickly. I want to be strong and tough right now. Okay, let's go. But you're gonna have to work really hard to be like this, Mikey. I'd do anything to beat these fools. You're gonna be a tough jock, Mikey. Yes, I will lift cars with my hands and girls will fall in love with me because I have a lot of muscles. JJ, why haven't you become a jock yet, too? Because I'm too cool. I don't need big muscles, and they won't bother you because you're small and weak. Um, I'm small and weak because I'm not old enough. These are just your stupid excuses to keep being weak and small. And in this gym, you will finally grow up and become a real man. Oh, yeah. Only real men will be here. Do you see the bearded man on the sign? Soon you will be the same. Oh, yeah. I also want abs on my stomach and a cool black beard. The beard beard grows after the muscles. Let's make a cool man out of you. Oh yeah, I love dogs. They're so cute. Uh, dogs? Is this really the coolest gym? Yes, this is the coolest gym. What did you want? Become big and strong? I need to make my buddy as strong as you, dude. What? Pump up this kid? Seriously? Oh yeah, I want to beat all the old school kids to my school. I understand. That's a good goal. I'm going to make a tough guy out of him. Yay! Mikey will become big and scary. Everything is as I wanted. But I don't want to be scary. It doesn't matter. Getting on the treadmill and start running. Okay, I can already feel the muscle growth. It is wonderful. Try your best, Mikey. Hey, buddy, don't you want to get pumped up too? Um, no, I'm already cool. I don't need it. Better work out with Mikey. He really needs it. Okay, soon you won't recognize him at all. Okay, bye-bye, everyone. I'm so proud of Mikey. He will grow up to be a real man. Friends, would you like to go to the gym? Write about it in the comments. To begin with, you can just do light physical education at home. One semester later. Hello, everyone. It's been a while. Has 
isn't it? While Mikey is working out at the gym, I've prepared a super duper surprise for him. This is a computer store that will soon become his. Just imagine how happy he will be that he will have his own profitable business. So cool. I even prepared this cool signboard. It looks great. The wall of diamonds cost me a lot of money, you know. You know, baby, you can feel safe with me. Oh, Mikey, you're so strong and brave. And here's my friend. He's already hooked up with some girl. You are the most beautiful girl in the world. Hey, Mikey, come here. I got a surprise for you. Oh, this is my friend JJ. He's a really cool guy. Hey, JJ, what's your surprise? He's obviously got some kind of funny prank for me. No, no pranks this time. Mikey's getting to be too much of a grown-up dude. Oh, yeah, he's too big and a grown man. Oh, yes, you need a good woman for a man like that. Anyway, for Mikey, I prepared this store that sells computers. It belongs to you now, buddy. Uh, uh you want me to be a businessman? Oh, yeah, this business will make you tons of money, and you're gonna be a successful man. Oh, yeah, thank you, JJ. That's very cool of you. I'm going to make tons of money and become not only pumped up, but a rich guy. Oh, yeah, come on inside. It's your store now. Honey, now you and I can have the coolest wedding ever. Thank you again, JJ. You're welcome, Mikey. As long as you're happy, buddy. So glad he's doing well. Guys, do you help your friends? Write about it in the comments. Mikey's my best friend. Four to six days later. Are you ready to be husband and wife? Oh, yeah, I agree. Yes, I agree. Are you ready to live together in peace and harmony until life pulls you apart? Yeah, I agree. Yeah, I'll agree to anything. Are you willing to give me more money? I don't have enough. Uh, no, I disagree. You have a lot of money already. Look at their wedding. I'm so happy for them. Then I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss each other. Oh, I think it's too young for you guys to be looking at this. Uh, I'm not supposed to show you this. Have you ever been to a wedding? Write about it in the comments. Next to you, I'm the luckiest guy in the world. Me too, honey. That's so cool. Guys, like this video. Subscribe to our channel. Did you hear that? What was that? Yeah, it's from here. It looks like something fell in. Is that a basket? Oh my god, it's a baby! How did he end up here? Someone left him behind. Poor little guy. Do you think we can keep it? Like it sounds cool? Yeah, I'd like to take him in. He seems nice. I think we should take him in. Yeah, sure. Let's go inside. Let's get him fed and warmed up first. Yeah, you can take him, and I'll make him something for the kids to eat. Come on, I'll put him on the bed. I don't think he'll be okay. I should be more careful with him. Yeah, sure. I think he'll be fine there. Yeah, sure. Close the door, please. Ah, what a beautiful day. That that's how I ended up with these parents. Hello, everyone. It's nice weather to go out today. I should ask my parents if I can go out. I'd like to go to the playground. Hey, Mom, Dad, can I go outside, please? Oh, son, you're too young to go out alone. But the playground just around the corner, I'll be close. Darling, we can't go with you. Why? We have business to attend to, but it's not safe to let you go alone. You could be kidnapped by evil people. What? Wow. Yeah, it's true. There are villains in the world who like to kidnap kids from playgrounds, so you won't grow up. You'll have have to play in your room. But that's the way I wanted it, but it's okay. I'm sorry, honey, but that's just the way it is. Yeah, I know. Well, I'm gonna go play with my toys in my room. It's good that he understands. Who can hear me? Five seconds and they're back to talking to each other like they always do. About cartoons, okay? At least I have something to watch because I like cartoons and I have a lot of toys to play with. So it's kind of fun in my room too. And I'll definitely find something to play with my toys. Six months later. Wow, today's my first day of school. I've heard a lot about this place. I hope it's cool because I'm gonna have to go there a lot to be ultra smart and rich. And there's a bunch of kids there. So hopefully I'll make some friends and we'll spend a lot of time together and have fun. Hey son, I hope you're ready for your first day of school. Yeah, sure. We're on our way out. I'm so glad you're going to school. Yeah, me too. Let's go to the car. You'll make a lot of friends there and you'll get a lot of useful knowledge. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. I'd like to make a couple friends, have some fun and walk down the street. 
There'll be tons of your peers there. Wow, okay, I like it. I'm sure you'll make a few friends. Come on, let's get in the car. We might be late. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready to go. I can't wait. Come on, let's go. Oh, I'm so excited. Come on in. Okay. I'll get in the car too. Yeah, sure. I'll get in the car too. This must be a very important event in my life if you're as excited as I am. Yeah, it's very important that you learn everything in school. Like what? You know, like, uh... And also, math is very important. You can count money. It's a prestigious job, and it pays very well. Oh, okay. We're finally here. Wow, I've never seen such beautiful buildings before. It's going to be very interesting. We should hurry up and not be late for the first lesson. Oh, don't worry. You can take your time. Class starts soon, but you still have time. And behave yourself. It's important. All right, I'll try, and I'll try to be top of my class. All right, we gotta go. Good luck. Happy first day. Yeah, good luck at school. I hope you do well, and we'll be proud of you. Wow, thank you, good luck to you too. I will behave well in school and try to be my best self there. Thank you. Well, I guess it's time for me to run to my first class. Hope I'm not late and it's not too hard. Cool. I've never studied before today. I hope it's fun and the school looks handsome. I've never seen a school before, but this one looks really nice. So where do I go? It looks like some kind of class, but it's empty and it says like and subscribe. Hmm. Looks like it's for some kind of channeling class. Cool. But my class should be filled with kids like me. I think it's around here somewhere, but it's definitely around here. I should go in. I hope the teacher doesn't get mad that I'm a little late because I got lost. Oh, and here is the teacher. Hello, teacher. I'm a new student. New student? Yeah. Hmm. Uh, yeah. JJ, well, sit next to me. You can sit with Mikey. Who's that? That's me. It's his first time here today, too. Uh, hi, and Mikey. Hey, hi, I'm JJ. Oh, I see you two. We'll get along. All right, sit down. We're about to start class. Yeah, okay, I'll sit down. Well, I hope you brought your textbooks because because Mikey forgot them. Yeah, 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 I got all the textbooks. Oh, good for you. You should share it with Mikey so you two can be friends. All right, let's get this lesson started. Wow, good thing I brought all my textbooks. Wow, you're good. I'm glad you sat next to me. Yeah, me too. Okay, kids, today your first lesson will be geometry, a very simple lesson. Three hours later. Okay, finally school's out. Now I have plenty of free time. I can rest. Write in the comments if you like school. Hey, you're JJ, aren't you? Hi. Hi, I'm Mikey. Can we be friends? Hey, it's me. Nice to meet you. I don't mind. Do you have plans to do anything after school? Generally, no, but I like to go for a walk or spend time in good company. If you want, we can go for a walk together. It would be much more fun. Or if you have something to do, I can walk you home. You don't live far away, do you? Okay, come on. Oh, who's that? She looks cute. Oh, she's the coolest girl in our school. I heard that her parents are very important people in town. Do you think if I went over to meet her, what would she say? Do you want to meet her? Apparently, you're very uninhibited. Well, it's probably worth a try, but I don't think she's going to talk. She's a little arrogant. Hey, wait. Hi, my name's JJ. How about I meet you? You're very pretty. And I was thinking we could go out together. What? You? No. Have you seen yourself in the mirror? In fact, you look like some kind of pauper. So get out of here before I complain about you. I don't hang out with losers like you, so don't come near me again. You're gonna get hurt. I hope you understand me, so get out of here. Yeah, it's not exactly a pleasant encounter. Well, I didn't really want to be friends with her. Mikey, you were right. She has a nasty temper. Well, then we're definitely free to go for a walk together. I'm sure she would have ruined our free time for sure. But first, look at this board. Oh, I see what you mean. Subscribe and like is the best support for the channel. Now we can definitely have fun. Let's go. Ha ha, yeah, JJ, come on. Ten years later. And so, after all this time, I can finally welcome everyone to the opening of my luxury appliance store. I can't wait to be inside and show everyone what my store looks like inside. Hey, JJ, hi, long time no see. How you doing? Wow, is this your store? Oh my gosh. Yes, I worked very hard to open it. Let's go inside and I'll show you what's in there. Wow, JJ, you're doing great to be able to pull this off. Thanks, Mikey. Don't be shy. Come on in. You'll be my first client. Here, look. There are computers and laptops of the latest models. I can give you a good discount because we are friends. Wow, that's so cool. This stuff costs a lot of money. You're going to be rich in no time. Thank you, Mikey, for your support. If you need to upgrade your computer, you know who to go to. We'll find you the best one. Okay, it's a deal, JJ. Now I'll come to your store for advice. Oh, who's coming? That's the popular girl from high school who blew me off. 
Hey guys, I almost didn't recognize you. Whose store is this? I haven't seen him around here before. Oh, it's my own high-end hardware store. Computers, laptops, TVs. Wow, that sounds really cool. Yeah, that's what I think too. Listen, do you want to go out with me? Like a movie or a coffee shop? You didn't even want to talk to me last time. Maybe yes, maybe no. We'll see. But I guess I'll see you around, hee <laughs> hee. Yeah, she hasn't gotten any weirder since high school. Why does she keep blowing me off? I don't get it. Hmm. Maybe you should get more pumped up. I hear girls like that. Like they feel confident around tough, strong guys. Get pumped up? Well, since my store didn't surprise her too much, you're probably right. Then I'll go to the gym to work out and gain muscle mass. And then she won't dare refuse me. Okay, starting today, my personal training program begins. I had to buy out the entire gym for this time, so no one would know what I was doing. Because I want to wow everyone I know. I'm sure everyone will be thrilled with my transformation. Four to six days later. Great. Training is is over. And now I can proudly proclaim that I have become the best version of myself. Now everyone will definitely be jealous of my success. I'm 100% sure of myself. What a wonderful feeling. Haha, <laughs> yeah, no one can resist me now. Look at me. I think that's a pretty good result. It's a great gym, by the way. I recommend it. They'll make you look so good. Oh, look, here comes that girl who's always talking over me again. Hi, how do I look? Oh, JJ, is that you? You've changed. You're so cool now. Ha ha ha. Yeah, I've spent a lot of time at the gym. So now I'm sure you can't refuse my offer. Yeah, sure. What do you want to offer me? Okay, then I want to ask you something very important. Will you marry me? Although I'm sure you will. Wow, JJ, are you serious? Of course I am. I mean, you're so cool and rich and pumped up. I can't think of anything better. Okay. Okay, then let's not waste any time, and right now, let's call all our friends, go to church, and get married. Yes, of course, I'll call everyone. Moments later. All right, on this glorious day, by the power vested in me from above, I pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss each other, and we will, with a round of applause, consider the ceremony closed. Congratulations to you, newlyweds. Yay, JJ! Congratulations to you! And you guys don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this- And a dash of salt, and like, yeah, it's done. Mm? What a nice smell. I think it's time to set the table and call these gamblers in for dinner. I finally finished making this dinner. Complicated recipe, but looks quite delicious. Hope the boy likes it, otherwise I'll be upset. I hope they're not wearing headphones, or they won't hear me. Boys, dinner's ready, come on down. I hope you heard me, huh? Hey, everybody. Yes, ma'am. We're coming. We're almost done playing the game with Dad. There's not much left to do. You've got one more enemy to level. Come on, it's right here. Oh, yeah. And then we can enchant the whole set of armor. Yeah, it'll be cool. Then no one can stop you and you can defeat that dragon. Hey, 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 this skeleton can't hurt me because my shield reflects his arrows. Oh, looks like Mom called us for dinner. Come on. I think we've played well enough for today. We could go on after dinner just a little while longer. Well, maybe. We'll see. I'm a little tired of sitting and playing for so long. Yes, to fall. Farm, so much experience takes a lot of time. This is the disadvantage of such games. You need to grind a lot to get cool stuff. I don't like it, but mom looks like she made something delicious. I've been waiting for you for 15 minutes. The food's getting cold. We're on our way, right, Dad? Yeah, we're a little late, but that's okay. We have a character with 30 levels of experience. Yeah, me and my dad earned a lot of experience so we could make cool armor and be unbeatable. Oh, that's very good. But how are you doing at school? Well, it was. I heard bad news from the teacher. Yeah, I got got an F on my last test. Oh my gosh, why'd you get an F? Well, I, uh, it was a difficult theme and the teacher didn't really explain it and gave a test on it. Wow, who could that be at this late hour? JJ, are you expecting some friends over for a sleepover? I don't have a lot of friends at school who know my address. I should open it. I don't even know who it could be. All right, I'll look, but stay behind me in case it's some muggers or something. They could get hurt. All right, good, JJ, stay close. I'm not afraid of some mugger. I went to boxing and I know how to fight. Yeah, but people can be bigger than you and- Ooh. I'm sorry to disturb you at this late hour. But could you take me in? I'm soaked and hungry. Wow, that's unexpected. I've been wandering the streets all day and I'm so tired. I have nowhere to go. Wow, but what happened to you? Our house burned down and my parents abandoned me because they wouldn't give me food. Wow, that's too bad. Mom, Dad, we have to let him in. He's been through so much. Oh, this is hard, but I guess it's okay if he stays with us for a while. I could be useful. Well, okay, that's doubtful. But okay, well, I guess that'll do. I think it's right that we help him. What's your name? My name 
name is Mikey. Okay, Mikey. I guess you can stay in JJ's room until we figure something out since it was his idea. My room's really cool. It's got tons of toys and room for two. I love toys. But first you need to go wash up. You're covered in mud. I fell a couple times while I was walking and I fell in a puddle of mud. It was unpleasant. Yeah, it's noticeable. Wow, he looks cool. Yeah, he's just adorable. What are we gonna do? I think he's gonna live with us now. What? I suggested he stay with us for a while, not for life. JJ, he has nowhere to go and the shelter will only make it worse. He is. This way he'll have a good life at least. Oh God, okay. I think he'll be a good boy and a little kindness to him will help us make him a better man. And we've got room for one more kid so there's no problem with space. Yeah, sure, cool. I washed up and now I look nice and clean. You're just like monstrously clean. We've thought about it and decided that you can live with us now and be part of our family. We're just setting the table for dinner. You can join us. Oh yeah, mom made a super delicious dinner. I think you're gonna love it. I don't know about that, but I loved it. Yeah, it smells really good and I'm really hungry and any food seems super delicious to me right now. Yeah, enjoy. Yes, dear, she's an excellent cook. It's true, mom always cooks something incredible and delicious. Mmm, it tastes delicious. I can't imagine you wandering around in this rain. Thank you for hosting me and giving me such good food. Well, now you live with us and you'll always have good food and a friendly family, so enjoy it. Your story is so sad, but we'll try to make your life here a lot better than it was before. Yeah, we're a good family. And we have enough money to make you happy too, so don't worry. Will you really let me stay and live with your family? Are you serious? JJ, we talked about this and besides, it's probably time for you to go to bed. You've got school tomorrow. Yeah, okay, all right, I get it. It's, uh, wow, cool. And you'll go with Mikey. It'll be good for him to go to school too. Wow, I never went to school. Yeah, cool. I'll take him to school. In the meantime, we'll go to bed. Thanks for dinner. Yeah, I'm glad you liked it. JJ, I hope you show Mikey your room and while you're at it, you can sleep on the same couch. Yeah, of course, I'll show him everything. Good night and sleep well. Good night? Yeah, you too. I'm gonna go show Mikey his new room. Wow, is this really your room? Yeah. I just had a corner at the end of the hall with a couch. Well, you can lie on your right side. There's plenty of room for two, so I won't mind if you sleep with me. Wow, thank you so much. I used to sleep on the floor, but this place is so cool. Wow, he fell asleep instantly. He must be really tired after that walk. Okay, it's awful that he's living with me now, but what can you do? So good night, everybody. I'm going to bed. The next day. Yay, school's finally over. Let's go home. I got a bad grade. My dad's gonna be mad at me. You're all so stupid. I'm the prettiest girl in school. Yeah, JJ. Your classmates at school aren't as smart as me. I think they're pretty normal guys. They're fun to play with. JJ, if you hang out with them, you're gonna be a dumb kid. Uh, like you're the smartest guy in the world, buddy. Oh yeah, I'm much smarter and better than you and your classmates together. Uh, I don't think so. My parents will obviously be pleased when they see my grade on the school test. You're such a braggart. I don't like it at all. I just know my place, and you need to know yours. Hey, why don't you not tell your parents about our grades? Because I'm not doing so good. Ah, uh, but I have a normal grade. My parents are going to get upset about my grade and beat me up for it. Okay, I won't talk about the test. Thanks, Mikey. I knew I could always trust you. Don't worry. It's going to be super cool. Uh, okay. Mom, Dad, hi. It's so good to see you. Oh, it's our babies home from school. Hey there, kids. How are you doing? We had a school test. I did better than any anyone in the class. Hey, we had a deal with you. Wow, Mikey is so smart and awesome. Oh yeah, I am. <laughs> uh, yeah, Mikey's cool. By the way, JJ, show off your grades too. Uh, I lost my test sheet. Don't lie, JJ. Show me your grades now. Or we will punish you. Okay, okay, okay. Just don't get mad. I don't have the best grades, you know. Oh my God, rated E. That's the worst grade in the world. Looks like JJ will be dumb for the rest of his life. Hey, I'm not stupid. Take an example from Mikey. He's the smartest boy in the family. Thanks, Mom. I'm trying to be the best kid I can be for you. Oh, he's so nice and sweet. Now he's our favorite son. Come here. We will hug our smart and favorite son. Hey, I was actually your favorite son, and Mikey is not your son at all. Nobody wants a dummy son like you, JJ. Oh, that's it. I'm offended. Go away to your room. Guys, who do your parents love more, you or your brothers? Write about it in the comments. Now we don't need a JJ because he's too stupid. Then I don't need such unfaithful parents. I can live a normal life without your hugs. Uh, what? What? They already put Mikey's bed in here? Am I really gonna live with that arrogant, smarmy guy? It's so embarrassing. I always like living alone here. Never mind. It's time to play my favorite computer game, Roblox. I'm a real pro at it. Hey, no games, dummy. <laughs> what? Don't you dare touch my computer. I bought you this computer. You need to fix your grades and become as smart as Mikey. I don't want to become a boring freak like 
Mikey? Mikey's a good student, unlike you. And he's a better son than you. Let me play on the computer and you go read your books. What? Why can Mikey play and I can't? Because I don't have bad grades, unlike you. Come here, JJ. You'll have to study for the test again by reading 100 textbooks overnight. What? But I can't read that much in my whole life. I don't care. Study. Otherwise, we'll kick you out of the house. This is all just too unfair. How am I supposed to read this? It's just dashes and dots. Mikey could do it, and so can you. There's no letters. Oh, my God. Mikey, we love you so much. You're the coolest son in the world. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Mom, Dad. You're the best parents ever. Oh, my God. He's so cute. I've never heard JJ say that before. Hey, I used to say those words to you all the time. Shut up and read your school books. You're stupid. I can't read these. These books are unreadable. Hey, are you all crazy? Hey, 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 hey. JJ really can't read. He's so stupid. Friends, do you realize what's written here? Write about it in the comments. I feel so bad that Mikey is sitting at my computer. Oh, my God. I'm never going to get my grades fixed. Three hours later. No one in my family loves me anymore. I'll never be able to fix my grades. I don't belong there anymore. Because everybody loves Mikey now. It seems unlikely that anyone will notice that I've left the house. How could they swap me for Mikey? Guys, would you love me or would you love Mikey? Write about it in the comments. I think it's time to apologize to the parents. You should be a good son. Oh, what's that sound? Ah! Oh, what was that? I got hit by a car? I can't believe I had such a terrible nightmare. It's a good thing I'm alive. It's so good to be in my home. Time to apologize to my parents and try to be their favorite son again. Looks like I fell asleep while trying to learn all those high school textbooks. Thank you so much for this super duper cool gift. What? It's a Nerf blaster. I've wanted one of these for a long time. Now I'll be able to shoot a Nerf at a JJ. Hey, can I play with Nerf too? It's so cool. Hey, by the way, I totally forgot. Uh, why don't you notice me? Hello, I'm here. Talk to me. Friends, why don't they see me? Write about it in the comments. It's a good thing there's no annoying JJ around. Oh, yeah. Ha, ha, ha. He pisses me off, too. Oh, my God. What's happening? Why can I walk through you like a ghost? Have I become a ghost? I don't like this at all. What am I supposed to do? Ah, I don't want to be a ghost. Mom, Dad, help me, please. Oh, my God. What's happening? No. The next day. We're playing ball here with my dad and mom. It's so cool. Hey, everybody. Ha, ha, ha. They made me play ball. Um, mom's kidding. We don't pretend I made them all play with me. Catch the ball, JJ. Ha, ha. We're having so much fun. Oh, yeah. Mommy, catch the ball. Are you having fun? Uh, well, yes, of course. You know, I'd love to watch soccer on TV rather than play it myself. Stop whining, dad. Kick the ball to me. Okay, catch it. I got him. Ha, ha. I love playing catch with my family so much. Oh, my God. Kicking a ball in heels is so uncomfortable. Be patient. We need to make it look like a happy family for our son. Hey, what are we stopping for? The thing is, it's nighttime and it's time for you to go to bed. By the way, it's starting to get dark. It's time for the kids to go to bed. Oh, you're right. We've been playing with the ball for a long time. Ha ha. I didn't realize it had been six hours. It was real fun spending time with you, son. I'm so tired of him. Oh, what? What are you talking about? Uh, nothing. He, he, I was just kidding. We have a lot of important things to do tomorrow. Plus, JJ has to go to school tomorrow. Oh, I hate this school so much. But okay, since you've been playing with me all day, I'll obey you. What an obedient and good child we have, isn't he? Oh yes, JJ is a very good and obedient boy. <laughs> Thank you for such warm words. I love you, Mom and Dad. Go to bed already, fast! Uh, okay. Why do you have to yell like that? Uh, just kidding. For fun. Haha. <laughs> and Daddy and I need to talk after you go to sleep. Oh yes, we have to go. Good night, JJ. Good night to you. You are the best parents in the world. I love you. Yeah, you too. I'm so tired of him. You should know. Friends, do you play with your parents? Write about it in the comments. It's so cool. But you know what? I'm not tired at all. I don't want to sleep. Maybe I should watch cartoons. Listen, what are we going to give JJ? Hey, keep it down. He might hear. And besides, we've talked about this. What are they talking about? It's supposed to be a surprise. I'm sure he'll love it. And it will be a good gift for us too. Oh, that's what you mean. I can't wait for tomorrow. This is the coolest surprise for our son. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, yeah. As long as he doesn't hear us. It has to be the perfect surprise. Let's go to sleep because I'm tired of playing this stupid ball. Well, 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 surprise for me. Now that's interesting. I love surprises. I wonder what they have prepared for me. Could it be the new iPhone or a new video game console? I don't know. So interesting.
Oh, what a terrible sound. Someone's calling me. I've just got up, eh? Now, don't ring like that. I'm not deaf. Who's here so early? I hate being woken up so early by the doorbell. It's unpleasant. Anyway, it looks like he won't leave until I open the door. So let's see who's in there. I hope it's quick. I just got up and I'm hungry. So who's here? Hi. Oh. Hey, JJ, you want to go out? What? You're here so early for a walk? Yeah, I got up early and I wanted to go out. And I thought, why not go out together? And I wanted you to meet my girlfriend. What, you have a girlfriend? Girlfriend? Yeah, I met her the other day. She's cool. She's at my house. Oh, okay. Well, at least let me eat and then we'll go out. Cool. I'm really hungry after my nap. Okay, I'll meet you at the park. I'm out of here. Yeah, go. Good luck. Me too. I'm gonna wake up. Wow, he's got a girlfriend. I guess I overslept like a thousand years. Fantastic start to the day. So yeah, dinner. Hmm, what a nice park. You can wander around forever. Where's Mikey? I thought he'd be here before me. I guess I was too quick. Or Mikey, as usual. I hope I don't have to wait too long. Um, and here he comes, running like a madman. And he's without a girlfriend, so it looks like she's out there somewhere and we're going to go see her. Hey, 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 JJ, what's up? Fine. I got here as fast as I could. You're just being your usual self and without a girlfriend. Hey, well, she couldn't come with me, but she said she'd come later. Okay, let's wait for your mystery girlfriend who got me out to the park this early. Honestly, she'll be here soon, like she told me. Yeah, yeah, I hope it doesn't take forever. Hey, here she comes. What? Wow. You didn't believe me. Yeah. I told you she was beautiful. Yeah, well, she looks wow. Not bad, though. Surprising. Me, you're being your usual grumpy self. You know, I don't like being woken up by doorbells and dragged to the park to meet someone. Hey, hey, sorry I'm late. Hey, hey. Hey, Mikey, is this your friend? Yeah, that's JJ, my best friend. Yeah, I'm JJ. Nice to meet you. It's so nice to meet you. Mikey, Mikey's talked about you so much. Yeah, Mikey told me about you too. That you two met and now you're together. And like we met a while ago and like we're a couple now, so. I think we should go for a walk. So tell me, how did you two meet? Well, it's a specific story, but I think you'll like it. Yeah, it was funny. I can't wait to hear the beginning. Three hours later. This evening was just, um, wow, there are no words. Thank you for sharing your story of how you met. We're glad you enjoyed it. We had a great time, too. It was awesome. Yes, we're very happy to have you with us, JJ. It's evenings like this that bring us even closer. Thank you. You really are a wonderful couple. I'm happy to see you like this. Well, we gotta go. See you soon, JJ. I think we can go out tomorrow, too. Yeah, see you soon. Take care of yourself. Of course, you too. Good night. Have a good night. All the best. And so on. Well, that couple, I gotta see what they're up to. To. That girl looks cool. Lucky Mikey, she fell for him. I gotta find out what she likes. Maybe she'll dump him and I don't know. I'll be able to date her. All right, what we got here is high. Oh, it so what was the surprise you wanted to tell me? There's something I wanted to discuss with you. I had a very interesting day today. I got a new job offer. Really? That's great. Tell me more. Wow, he got a job too, yikes. This is a really cool job with a great company. They offer great conditions and high salary. It can improve our financial situation a lot. And plus, you can afford to buy yourself more nice things. That sounds great, Mikey. But something's bothering you, isn't it? Yes, the thing about this job is that it can take a lot of time. I understand. It's really important. But if it improves our future and gives us more opportunities, I'll support you. We'll deal with it like we've dealt with all the difficulties before. Hmm, he'll be away a lot of the time. And what kind of job is that? I wonder if I can find out how long he'll be away so I can go to the next day. So I thought I'd wait till Mikey went to work and stopped by his girlfriend's house. We could hang out a little while he's gone. I don't think that's a bad thing, so. Where's Mikey? He's due today. Um, so here he is. Go on, run back to your job where you'll be swamped and don't even worry. I'll look after your girlfriend, trust me. Come on, hurry up, get out of here. I'm sure the boss is pissed at you for being late. Hopefully he'll be busy working all day and all night. He's finally gone. So what have we here, my beauty? I'm on my way to you. I gotta wait a couple seconds and go to her place. Hopefully she'll let me come in and we can talk and maybe take a walk together while Mikey does his hard work. I'll entertain her for him. He he. So I'm ready. I think it's time to go over and meet her. I don't know what she sees in Mikey. He's not the most pleasant person to talk to. So uh, I'm better. Hi. Mikey, are you home? I'm here to visit. It's JJ. JJ? Hello. Is that you? Yeah. Hey, Mikey's gone to work and won't be back for a while. Oh wow. It's so sad. May I come in to see you? Oh, well, come on in. Wow, thank you so much. I'm always happy to visit. You 
You are so kind. I think Mikey is very lucky to have you. He hasn't seen such beautiful and kind girls before you. Oh, come on. You're embarrassing me. But it's completely true. So do you want to watch cartoons or play games? Oh, wow. I think we could go over everything one at a time and... Ha ha ha, that's so funny. You're funny. Thank you. Your pie is great. Yeah, I'm a chef and I can cook a lot of interesting things. Wow. I remember when we fell out of the plane with Mikey. We were so hungry. I wish you were here. Yeah, Mikey told me. It's a funny story. And then he was like, man, I'm all messed up. And he was just covered in paint. <laughs> That's so funny. I hope he was okay afterwards. You should have seen him walk around for a week with paint all over his body and... So now I'm walking. I don't even know where to go. What do I do? Oh, you have to go around and stand on dots to buy them. That's what you have money for. Ah, uh, now I see. I get it. Okay, let's see. You roll the dice and go for the number of dice. It's easy. Yeah, I got it. Okay, I'll be right there. Take your time. We have all the time in the world. Wow, JJ. I didn't know how cool you were. You're so nice to hang out with. Yeah, you're really cool too. I think we could get together more often and have such a good time. It's cool. Yeah, I think sometimes you can have so much fun. It's a really good time. Oh, oh no, it's Mikey from work. Yeah. Get out of here. He can't see you've been here all day. Uh, okay. I'll try to get out the window and you go meet him and hold him off. All right, come on, but be quiet and don't leave a mark. Yeah, yeah. Honey, will you get it? I forgot my keys. I'm back from work. I'm so tired. Wait a second, Mikey. I'm coming over, honey. You're back. I'm so glad. I've been working so hard. It's just something. I'm super tired. Come on in. I'll make you something tasty, my tiger. Oh, wow. I can't wait. You're gonna love it. I don't know. He came in and didn't see me. I gotta get out of here before he sees me. I think that would be suspicious. I had a good time with this girl. I like her. I'll have to go see her again sometime. She's so cool. I love her. So, yeah. Four to six days later. I've been staying with the beautiful woman who lives in Mikey. And today, she's as beautiful as ever. Oh, JJ. You flatter me as always, but I enjoy your company. Mikey is often not at home, and I am sad and lonely. It's good to have a decent boy like you who is always there to comfort my loneliness. I'm always happy to help you in your business, and I always enjoy your company. You have a good character, and you're a cool person to talk to. Yeah, but I feel so bad that Mikey's not home all the time. I don't think he loves me, and he doesn't even want to live with me. Anymore. Don't worry. I'm always here for you, and I can keep you company in times of need. Oh, thank you. You're always so good. Yeah. I love how you always cheer me up. I don't know what I'd do without you. Oh no, looks like it's Mikey again, man. Oh what? He's early today. Yeah, he's a little early. It's weird. You need to get out fast. But where to? Mikey changed all the windows. Now they won't open. Hide in the next room. I'll distract him. Okay. I'll try not to make any noise. Distract him and I'll run away. I'll try, but don't make any noise and hide somewhere. All right, well, we gotta do something, so I'll eavesdrop, see if I can hear anything. I think I'll hear if he's coming this way or somewhere else and sneak a moment to escape. Oh, darling, what took you so long to open up? I got here early. I wanted to make you happy. Oh, he seems to suspect something. It's getting dangerous. Oh, honey, I've been so busy. I'm sorry it took me so long to open it. I'm tired. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I hope you cooked something. Oh, oh, no. What's that noise coming from the bathroom? Sheesh, we gotta hide. So, uh, where am I going? What's going on here? Here. Why did I hear that? It's weird. There's nothing here. Maybe I imagined it. I guess I'm sick after work. Okay, I'm gonna go change. My clothes stink after this job. It's weird. I seem to be getting glitches after these reworkings. Yeah, just glitches, he. But it's better than me finding someone and finding out my girlfriend's cheating on me. But that's just paranoia, thank God. Okay, I'm gonna go. Wow, that was close. Good thing Mikey's not very smart and not paying attention. That was close. I've been here till one in the morning, and I think Mikey's gone to bed. Besides, I haven't heard a noise in half an hour, so I think it's clear. Time to get out of here. But the windows are closed, and there's no way out but to go through the kitchen and the entire west side to the front door. Oh, JJ, I'm sorry it took so long. Hurry up while Mikey's gone. He's gone? Okay, then it's time to run. Yeah, but be careful. He might hear you. I'm as quiet as a mouse. He won't even know I was here. Quiet. He's sleeping right here. Don't make any noise. I'm trying to be quiet. I just just need to get through, that's all. He's a heavy sleeper, so I guess it won't be a problem. Lucky you. Yeah, lucky me. What? Did you hear that? Shh, quiet. Was it just me or did he say something? I don't get it. I think he just mumbled. Don't stand there. We should leave if he wakes up. I'm so happy about this situation. What? We're on the edge and we're still together. It's invigorating. Yeah, I like you too, but... No buts. I didn't notice before, but now I realize I like you. Wow, I love you too. I didn't think I'd say that. Oh, honey, you can say that forever to me. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> You're 
so good. You're not bad either. You're adorable. You're even more adorable. I don't know how I didn't realize it before. You're so caring and nice. I've been meaning to say for a long time. I love you too. I love you too. I can't believe it. I loved you from the first time I saw you in the park. I didn't know what to say. Ahem, uh ahem. Uh when I started noticing that my stuff was in the wrong places, I thought I was imagining things. But when I heard a noise in my room today, I figured it out. Uh, Mikey's not what it looks like. Mikey, JJ's just... I heard everything. And stop lying. Both of you. Dude. I'll punch you. Yay. Ouch. Mikey. Yes. Oh, please stop. You're hurting me. Stop. We're cheating.